find of the day and I'm absolutely pumped. Unfortunately it's slightly damaged which I'm going to get repaired because this is an absolute beauty. Victorian era 100% because this is a really old field. A little ring, an old belt, a belt ring. Now it's broken there but I'm going to get this thing repaired. And uh, got a lump of clumpy dirt in there which is rock hard. Silver. And I'll just carefully, carefully get this stuff out the centre. Um, I'll do that and I'll get back to you guys but this is a really cool find. Happy with that. Well guys, got the dirt out of it. And it's hallmarked and it's a little belt. It is cool, it's got graving all the way around. It's sadly it's broken, but I don't care, I'm getting that fixed. It's just broken there, that'll be easy to fix. But that is super cool, I'm very happy with that. What a cool little thing. This will be Victorian. I'm gonna take a punt at probably up to 1910. But what a cool find guys. Happy as anything with that. That is amazing. I'll be getting that one done, all fixed up. Top stuff. Hey everybody, welcome back and finally had this ring repaired, restored and it came up a treat. Absolute beauty. Hallmarks are LEN for Lewis Edward Neal, Northampton Street, Birmingham and the F on there means 1880. So um, it's got some sliding gate engraving on the side and the the jeweller, which was Marion Constantine in London Court, per City. Absolute beautiful. He does such a great job. And this is now going to be given to Lisa. The buckle signifies um, being given to someone uh, for a token of love. As in the buckle and belt go together perfectly. So just the history behind this is amazing. Who had it? Who brought it over from England? You know, it really makes you wonder what a beautiful piece of history was saved and fixed and now restored to its original beauty. Thanks everyone, hope you enjoyed watching and we'll try and get out and save some more relics.